I'm going to do a tutorial on some tricks and everything, basics, like how to throw and how to wind up an unresponsive yo-yo. And I would recommend getting this video, like, off of Amazon. It's only, like, $10. Flip side. Alright, first, how to throw. Normally, people will just throw like that. That's a no-no. Can't get any power doing that. What you need to do is throw like this. Move y'all real quick. Like I said, what you need to do is throw like this. Because this versus this. So yeah, then how to, I just told y'all how to throw it. Well, you want to make sure that, well, first of all, the, the string is on the top. It's coming off the, it's coming off the top of your hand. Because this will roll off. Versus if you had it on the bottom. It doesn't exactly roll off. Mm. Versus this. Well, kind of. But, yeah. Now, Honda will wind this back up. Throw it down. Then, bring one piece of the string around and under the yo-yo. And let go of the other. So, I'm going to do it up close. Yeah. So, there's the... Now I guess we can do some basic tricks. Uh, first, rock the baby. I oh, know the sleeper first. Just throw it down. Let it let it sit at the end of the string. That's called a sleep. That's called a sleep. That's called. Well, I'm trying to say whenever the yo-yo does that, it's called what people call it is they say the yo-yo is sleeping because it's just sitting there at the end of the string. Then you gotta wind it back up, like I said. Put it in front, under, yeah. So that's the sleeper. Throw it down, wind it up. Now, for rock the baby. Throw it down, grab about middle of the string, pull, use your, your middle finger, grab right below the yo-yo, right above then you have this triangle you want to put the yo-yo in between this triangle and you can just rock it then wind it back up come on so what that looks like again bring it down grab right here here make Make your hand flat while holding the string and do that. So yeah, then um walk the dog. I'm gonna show y'all it first, so then I'm gonna tell y'all how to do it. So, yeah, pretty simple, uh, pretty self-explanatory. Just throw it down. You kind of want to get a tiny swing going into it, then just let it roll. Can't let it roll too much, because then that'll make it go out of, I guess, lose speed, yeah? So you have to pull it up after a small bit. But yeah, so... Put it into a sleeper, put it onto the ground, pick it up, and wind it back up with the bind. Uh, now around the world. Very right, slow. So. I'm gonna go into a different room real quick. Hold up. Always make sure you have good room around you. Alright, so around the world. Normally, someone would go like that, but what I do, throw down, then... Swing it to make a giant circle, and that looks like your yo-yo supposedly 
going around the world. Hold up. All right. And if your yo-yo ever stops spinning, a way to wind it up, especially with this one, put it on the, if like this, if like this, grab the yo-yo, cut the string in half, first, make sure there's not really any of those twisty things in your string. Cut in half, put the yo-yo on, pull the string up well, that's attached to your finger. So like I said, go around the world. So then you gotta stop and wind it back up. Uh, for this, we're actually getting pretty advanced. This is where this wide gap comes into play here. This is called the man on the flying trapeze. No. Yeah. So bring it down, have a swing to it, and boom. Now I grab this. Then you can do this. Never mind. So yeah. So throw it down, finger right here. You just swing, finger, boom. Now pull it down. And yeah. Now, this is what I call, it's kind of both of them combined. Man on the web. So bring it down, find trapeze. Then push it down, over, up. Do you want to land on that, on the front string? Dang. So, find trapeze. Then, off over, put your, have it right here, and put your finger right here, then it'll come up, you want to get it exactly like that, so I'm going to stop the yo-yo to show, show y'all, this is what it should look like, so you have the yo-yo in front, then you have these two strings in the back, then you want to get it to where it swings, you have the two strings like this, then it swings, put your pointer finger up, it will swing, go around that, yeah. And if it's spinning, it will keep the same like shape and everything. And it swings onto this front string. And if you want to do the full trick, you gotta also bounce it off of that onto the back strings, which is pretty hard. Like, see, I, I miss it all the time. But gotta wind it back up the bind. So like I said, man in the web, down, trapeze, then off, pointer finger, pointer finger, boom. Except I'm the except I'm on the wrong line. You wanna get it on that front line. Oh, so before you do this is right after you do the trapeze. It's it's some it's similar to the rock the baby. Down, get the rock the baby. Maybe do a few rocks. Then come onto the string onto your left, and you can flip it. So what that looks like is so you're gonna again rock the baby. Boom. Maybe do a few rocks. Then you see this. Bring it, well, if I'm facing your way, bring it onto this, this string right here. And now you have this. You can just swing that forward. And it should look like this. So, 
So I get to throw a few swings, get it onto the string, and yeah, you wind it back up. All right, now we get to the hardest trick in the video, boingy boing. So, actually let's do a brain twister first. So, throw it down. So how we did the bind, except get it from the back, pull it under. I don't pull it up, do pull it towards you. Well, what I'm trying to say is, so you have it like this. So you do, so if you have this, pull it down, stop spinning. Pull it down then, under the yo-yo. Stop spinning! No, this, there. Sure. It's not very, it's not, I'm just gonna spin it real quick. So you have it like this. Bring it down, under. You have this, put your pointer finger right here. And pull it towards yourself. I'll make it do that. Then wind it back up. It should look a little something like this. So, under. Why well, did not end it, so. Pull it under. But I'm not so crap, gosh. Give me a second. All right. So, wind her up. Like I said, she'll go something like this. Just bring it down, over, and pull it towards yourself. Then wind it back up with the bind. Now you can get the backwards part and the bind mixed up. Bind is coming forward and pulling under letting go of your thumb if it doesn't get tangled up then what the brain twister is is coming down behind it and pulling up and yeah now for the hardest trick. I just learned this myself, so chances are I'm gonna mess up. Boingy boingy. Like I said, I was probably gonna mess up. Let's try this again. Cleaning. So, stop going onto the other string. Yeah. <laughs> this is. Okay, whatever. I'm just gonna sh tell y'all how to do it. So you have it sleeping. Hold up. So, this is gonna be pretty hard. Bring it right. Do it like the brain twister, except don't go under. Put your finger right above the yo-yo and flip it onto the string that you're holding with your thumb. have it like this do it like brain twister 
pull it back. You have the yo-yo right here. Then point your finger right above the yo-yo. Give it a second. Right, so point your finger right above the yo-yo. Then you'd flip it up onto this string that you're holding with your thumb. Flip it up. So it goes onto the string. Flip it. That's the hard part. I always get it on the string beside it. Then bring your thumb or whatever down. You have to get it swinging, but otherwise, just go up and down with your hand. And if I can ever get the yo-yo back, it should look a little something like this. It's very complicated. Like I said, I always get stuck on that string. There you go. Then end of a bind. And yeah, that's it. I'm gonna end the video here. Bye.